not know, I'm a dad, which means that I have to follow the dad code. And one of the rules of the dad code is that when you have an electric drill, whether it be battery powered or not, you have to give it two test squeezes in order to make sure that it's good. You can give it more than two, but two is the law. You'll go to dad jail and be shamed, you know, in the dad community if you don't give it a test squeezes. This drill has a torque limiter, which is like the most badass fucking thing in the universe. Yeah, here's an example of the torque limiter in action. Doing my best with one hand. You hear that clickiness? That's fucking... That's badass as fuck. Yeah. Man points. The terrible just happened. I lost some serious man points by uh, my drill battery running out. But I'm going to make up for it because I pulled out my electric drill and it's got a hammer action and it's got this sideways handle for stability. So, you know, that's going to score me some extra dad points. You want to score some serious dad points? Check this out. Build workbenches out of fucking anything. Right here, I got this fucking tote filled with microphones and cables and shit. Over here, I got a toolbox filled with tools that I don't even, I didn't even remember that I had. Such a dad move. Fuck. Oh no, this is terrible. I just lost like 50 dad points. I just shattered this drill bit from putting it down rough. And uh, it just fucking broke. That's devastating. I don't know if I can come back from that. There's a big giant bow in this piece of wood. So I put it together on purpose like that so that I could stress the wood out and establish dominance. Gotta grab one of these sick five feet long outside clamps. Yeah, take that, bitch. I compressed it using sheer dad energy alone. This thing's a piece of shit, but uh, it'll probably last about three years outside. Um, and uh, I only paid about $5 in hardware to put it together. It's made out of garbage. So the other wood was 90 inches long, and this big piece is 96 inches long. And I've got this other piece that's in front of it. This is solid wood. The other piece is laminate. And uh, I'm going to do something really ghetto and cheat. Here's a piece that I cut off when I was making the last bed. And yeah. I'm going to fucking brace those together and make that fucking work, and that's going to be totally fucking ghetto. I just bought five pounds of drywall screws, the, the one-inch ones, not because I needed them to finish this project, but to establish dominance over other dads. Also, I got this Simpson Strong Tie uh, mending plate to join these two pieces right here. Obviously, that's totally fucking overkill, but that's how I roll. Alright, both of them are finished. Both made out of garbage, and, uh, I don't know. Should work out pretty good. They'll probably last like three to five years. 